a disaster. Not to keep your wits about you. Papa, I love Anne. I'm going to lose her. I'll let you in on a little secret. If she loves you, you won't lose her no matter what happens here. I should have known better. I asked for one lousy favor from him, and look, I should have known better. My whole life I should have put up with his nonsense. But I think of what I've been through because of him. The ribbings I took in school, the, the, the beatings I got defending him, the gawking stares every time we left the apartment because he'd always insist we walk arm in arm. I'd need a shirt for school and he'd buy me a blouse. <laughs> what about what he gave up for you? The vacations and holidays, the hours spent helping you with your homework that I'd spent sitting up with you in the sick room. Have you ever wanted for anything? Private schools, cars, cash, all the anything. Have you ever asked for anything that you were denied? Yes. How about a little respect for what I want? How about a little understanding? A little respect? A little understanding? How often is someone concerned with the tiniest thread of your life? Concerned with whatever you feel and whatever you touch. Look over there. Look over there. Somebody cares that much. How often does somebody sense that you need them without being told? You have a bird in your heart that you're proud to disclose. Look over there, look over there. Somebody always knows when your world spins too fast and your bubble has burst. Someone puts himself flat so that you can come first. So count all the loves who have loved you from now to the end of your life. And when you have had the loves who have loved you before, look over there. Somebody loves